This is uh, the Lufthansa Systems demo that we um, did together with SAP HANA. We have around 1 million geometries stored in the database. You can see here that we have, for example, waypoints. A waypoint is very interesting for the pilot because they have to fly from one waypoint to another waypoint. Um, these waypoints are connected with flight routes or the green lines are flight routes. And, um, we have stored data here from eight different airlines in the HANA database um, for three days. It's all public data and we have some weather events like an ash cloud. I can activate the ash cloud and then you see um, that there are some intersections uh, with flight routes. I can also just show the intersected flight routes. So these are currently going through the ash cloud. This could be a critical problem. Um, the ash cloud is actually moving. I can activate all these different layers and then I see how the S cloud is going uh, from Iceland to uh, Europe. Um, and if I look at all the intersections, then there will be a lot of intersections, of course. Um, this could be a problem. So uh, what you can do with this solution is you can deactivate the layer. Um, and if I just look at this ash cloud, I can show um, one Lufthansa flight, um, it's 2886, I guess, from uh, Frankfurt to the US. And uh, I have two blue flight routes which are going through uh, waypoints. If I activate the waypoints again, um, the HANA system is calculating an alternate route um, which is going around the ash cloud. And there's a cost model behind it where we calculate um, the maximum delay and how much additional money it would cost. Um, but still the flight can continue and we can fly around it. And um, we have a lot of other events um, defined. I can move to a different layer. Maybe we go to the US. If I zoom to this layer, then uh, we see um, the waypoints. I guess it's near uh, New York. And uh, here are also some um, weather events. In this case, it's a cyclone which is going to the um, US coast and um, there are a lot of um, intersections calculated. If I um, activate the layer with all the routes um, then you see um, there's also a time filter on it so this uh, weather event occurs to a specific point in time. We do it in 3D so there could be a flight route over um, an ash cloud in case of a cyclone, um, it's a little bit more complicated, I guess. And the interesting story about um, the demo is that we really have around 1 million geometries. And if I activate a layer, for example, this one, this is near Hong Kong. There are a lot of uh, flight routes, a lot of waypoints. And um, for the HANA database, activating one of these layers and showing a hurricane, which is uh, calculating an intersection in 3D and um, to a specific time point, we get immediately the response back. And I can do it for all the different layers. It's working out of the box for us. This is uh, just a simple demo, but it shows very good the uh, performance of HANA Spatial.